So this here is a fantastic case for someone who's getting comfortable taking out teeth and you're wanting to kind of do some third molars that are a little bit more involved but not too crazy. It's a young patient, she's 17 years old. Here we've got soft tissue impaction here on the upper right side, so just using a 12. And we're going in up around that second molar. Once we get through that papilla there, then we're gonna take our periosteal Get it underneath that flap. There's the tooth right there. You can see it. It's already right there. And then we get the 63B spade. We push that up in kind of alongside the distal of that second molar. Work it sort of palatal and apical up along the root. And out it pops. And we don't have to do any suturing or anything back there. That flap will lay nice there. It's just outlining where you'll find the next tooth, right? So same idea. We know exactly where it is. So we want to try to design our flap around that, right? So always have an idea why you're cutting the flap or why you're making it the shape that you are, right? You need to kind of guess why you're, or what you're going to be delivering through the opening and how big you need to make it. Here again, we can see that we're finding the tooth there. So we've got that flap released a little bit there. Same thing, we just engage that tooth. You can see it moving there now, leaning it up and out pops out through there and again we're good there with no sutures on the bottom we've got just that little operculum overlying that lower third molar just going to use a three millimeter luxator going to engage the tooth and we're going to lift up and out yeah there you go and then kick it over from the buckle once it's out of the socket or from the lingo i guess in this case that was a, a different move usually i go from the buckle uh, and there we got the three teeth sitting there you see the roots aren't developed yet fully which is great that's perfect timing for these uh, because they tend to come out quite easily and even something like that where the roots have a little bit of a curve to them right that lower one it still came out fairly easily just with elevation being a young patient and incomplete root development same thing here patients biting down we're supporting under the jaw levering up and out that tooth pops out of there and here is the school of fish at least it's what it reminds me of. <laughs>